Hi, this is Brian. And I'm Taya. And today we're going to be learning about Google Drive. You are now in your RCSD Google Drive. You will know you are in your RCSD Google Drive because you will see the RCSD icon in the top left of your screen. And if you hover over your initial on the right, you will see your RCSD one-to-one -one Google Drive login information. Your Google Drive is a cloud-based storage service. This means you can access it from any device that has the internet. On the left, the New button is what you click to add new files to your drive. You can upload files you already have from your PC or flash drive, or you can create new folders and documents right from your drive. Storing files in your drive is a great way to back up your files since it is cloud-based, and if your machine happens to crash, you won't lose your files. Under the new button, you see My Drive. If you click on My Drive, you can see the folders and documents stored in your drive. You can select to see your files in a list or a grid view. So right now I have mine in a grid view. If I click on this icon, I can switch to a list view. Some people like the grid view because it gives a little preview of what you have on the document. If you look under My Drive, you see Shared With Me. This is what you click to see the items other people have shared with your RCSD one-to-one -one Google account. A feature of storing files in your drive is that you can share them with other people instead of having to email attachments of various files. Google Photos is a place for you to store your photos that you may use with your class or that you take of your classes. Recent is what you can see is where you can see docs that you have worked on recently. If you know you worked on a file in your drive yesterday but can't remember what it was called, click Recent to find it. Starred will have all the files that you have added a star to for locating them quickly. These would be high importance documents you know you will need later. Trash obviously is where items you remove from your drive will go. Along the top toolbar, you will see the launcher grid. This is what you will use to access other Google apps. You will also see notifications, your account icon, which if you have multiple Google accounts, this is where you can click to sign out of your RCSD Google account. If you select a folder or a document in your drive, more links will appear in the lower toolbar. These links would be share, uh, for you to obtain a shareable link for your document, a way to share your document with a colleague or a student, preview, trash, and more. More is move to, add a star, this is where you can change your color for your folders, and so on. You can also right click on a document in your drive and access this information as well. For your first task, you are going to create a new folder for a course you will be teaching. To do this, click the New button and select Folder. You will then have to name your folder and click Create. You will now see this folder in your drive. Right click on your folder and change the color. So you right click, go down to change color. You can select any of the colors here. I'm going to make my folder blue. And now when I click on a different document, I can see this folder is blue. 